Semper Fidelis. The more Marines I have around, the better I like it. Every Marine is, first and foremost, a rifleman. We're not retreating, we're just advancing in a different direction. Pain is weakness leaving the body. Earned, never given. Freedom is not free, but the U.S. Marine Corps will pay most of your share. For the Marine Corps, tradition is not something to preserve, but to grow. No better friend, no worse enemy than a U.S. Marine. The Marine Corps has just been called by the New York Times, the elite of this country. I think it is the elite of the world. Marines die. That's what we're here for. But the Marine Corps lives forever. And that means you live forever. When the will defies fear, when duty throws the gauntlet down to fate, when honor scorns to compromise with death, that is heroism. Some people spend an entire lifetime wondering if they made a difference in the world. But the Marines don't have that problem. Marines I see as two breeds, Rottweilers or Dobermans, because Marines come in two varieties, big and mean, or skinny and mean. The Marine Corps is a brotherhood. There is no such thing as a former Marine. I have just returned from visiting the Marines at the front, and there is not a finer fighting organization in the world. The safest place in Korea was right behind a platoon of Marines. Lord, how they could fight. Marines know how to use their bayonets. Army bayonets may as well be paperweights. It doesn't take a hero to order men into battle. It takes a hero to be one of those men who goes into battle. In the Marine Corps, your buddy is not only your classmate or fellow officer but also the Marine under your command. If he gets killed, you lose a man and you have failed him. Marines are about the most peculiar breed of human beings I have ever witnessed. God damn it, you'll never get the purple heart hiding in a foxhole. Follow me. Marines don't know how to spell the word defeat. We signed up knowing the risk. Those innocent people in New York didn't go to work thinking there was any kind of risk. The Marines I have seen around the world have the cleanest bodies, the filthiest minds, the highest morale, and the lowest morals of any group of animals I have ever seen. Thank God for the United States Marine Corps. Marines are trained to improvise, adapt, and overcome any obstacle in whatever situation they are needed. This is what makes us Marines. A Marine is a Marine. I set that policy two weeks ago, there's no such thing as a former Marine. You're a Marine, just in a different uniform and you're in a different phase of your life. But you'll always be a Marine because you went to Paris Island, San Diego or the hills of Quantico. I have nothing to offer but blood, toil, tears, and sweat. Marines, we're looking for a few good men. This will remain the land of the free only so long as it is the home of the brave.